everybody welcome back to the Galloway Farm YouTube channel my name is Caitlin if you are new here and on our channel we post lots of gardening videos some recipes and then just lots of updates as to what's going on around the farm and if you are interested just take a second and make sure that you are subscribed so that you never miss an upload so in today's video I'm going to be planting in my green stalk vertical garden this is something i ordered recently and i'm pretty excited about it it's great for if you just have small space to garden in or if you don't have um, a permanent garden spot so i got the five tier planter and it came with this little guide to help you plant it tells you the steps so each one of these come apart you can tell right here it just snaps off snaps back on um, so you want to detach all of them and then you'll fill each of them with potting soil. This specific one is five tier. So it's going to take six gallons or 0.75 cubic feet of potting mix. Um, but you'll fill each of them with potting soil. You'll plant in each of these little pockets here and then you can stack it. And this um, little top reservoir here is for water. So this is how you water all the plants and that is it um, it also comes with little helpful tips on what to plant how much in each pocket and then just some like watering tips and general tips so I'm going to show you how this little guy comes apart so just to show you what I'm going to be planting today I have some marigolds parsley thyme oregano some flowers um, lavender and rosemary okay so like I said this is the water reservoir so this is what you put your water in to water your plants and then as I showed you this just snaps off the top and then we've got our first tier here so this is what we'll be putting the potting soil and our plants actually in and same here this just snaps off of the other one and then there's this little connector piece that goes in between each tier so what we're gonna start out doing is taking apart each tier and filling them with potting soil. We got a brand new day. Good love is on the way. And if you take my hand, I'll walk with you to Georgia. Have you ever been in love? Dove in from high above And if the answer's no Well then I'd like to get to know ya And though I know These lights are blinding I will guide us home Cause I don't know what I've been told The weather outside is not that cold And if you take my hand I'll walk with you Okay, so I've filled up all five tiers with potting soil and now it's time to add in some herbs and flowers. So for the bottom tier, I'm going to start out with the rosemary and some marigolds. I don't know that I'll have enough plants for each um, individual pocket of each tier, but that'll give me um, an opportunity later on to add more if I want to or even start some things from seeds. So let's get started with these. We got a brand new night. Good love will soon arrive And when it does then Come a little closer Have you ever seen the stars Burn out into the dark And as they go say It was nice to know ya first tier is planted I left one spot there just in case I wanted to plant something else on the bottom later on um, but yeah that tier is done so now we can move on to our next tier in the second tier I'm going to be planting some lavender I've also got two parsley plants and then we're gonna be planting some of these flowers and the lavender if you can see um, it's think about three plants in this one pot so I'm gonna separate those two just to give them more room to grow in here see 
next to me And if you take my hand, I'll walk with you to Georgia And if you take my hand, I'll walk with you to Georgia And if you take my hand, I'll walk with you to Georgia I've never been You do things that make me a better man And bus stops they turn into hours spent rambling on One look and you got the second tier is planted So we've got our lavender, parsley And then just one of those flowers So now we'll keep moving on to the other three tiers And then I'll update you again Whenever we're stacking the tiers Put in place to hide things we both know it's obvious there'll come a time I'll board a plane and leave behind the closest thing to home away from home. My mind will forget nights like these ones. I'm falling, I'm falling before I go again. I've tried to pretend time is on our side. Falling. I'm falling before I go again Falling Falling no. Falling I'm falling before I go again We talk late at night like we're letterman We're deeper right now than I've ever been Overthinking this would be irrelevant Chances are We'll end up in a bar tonight When drinks turn off the filter right Put in place to hide things There'll come a time I'll board a plane and leave behind the closest thing to home away from home. My mind won't forget nights like these ones. I'm falling, I'm falling before I go again. I've tried to pretend time is on our side. Falling, I'm falling before I go again. So we have planted all our herbs and flowers. I actually did a lot of marigolds. Marigolds are really good for repelling insects and other harmful pests, but they also attract bees, pollinators, and then other beneficial um, bugs. And then they also help enhance the growth of other herbs. So I did a lot of those, but we've got on our bottom tier here, the rosemary. I did marigolds and then I left a spot there. I think I'm going to get some mint and plant there. Um, and then in the next one, I did some parsley, the three lavender plants, and then one of the white flowers. And then here we did some marigolds and just flowers. Here we have, that's thyme, and then some oregano, and then some of the flowers. And then this is a little miniature tomato plant. I've never heard of it before, but we're just going to see what happens. I thought it would be a little fun plant to try and grow. Um, and then we've got some marigolds and some other flowers. So we're going to go ahead and start stacking those now. Okay, so this is going to be my bottom tier. I'm going to take one of these little separators and place it right in the middle. And then we can add our next tier on.
stack all five tiers on top of each other and the only thing I will add about this so right here you can see it clicks on to each tier it's kind of hard when you put one tier on top of the other for it to click right in place you kind of have to adjust it a little bit so it was a little hard not to smush each plant so like with the oregano this one's pretty bushy so it was really hard not to squish part of the oregano so the only thing i'll add about that is try and get maybe a smaller plant to plant in these or plant them right on the edge to where they just kind of overflow and don't get smushed or you could add the bushier plants into the top so now we're going to go ahead and put on the water reservoir and then water our plants if I grow up, even if something's missing if something's missing I'm still coming home I'm still coming home I filled the water to just this bottom line here and it is draining through that hole and then you can see it dripping through each tier I'm going to come back probably this evening and just check on the plants make sure they got enough water and see how they're looking I'm coming home Coming home. I wanna lay on these old streets. I wanna stay here for a while. So it's a lot later in the afternoon. I actually just watered my planter again. It's a really hot day, so I figured it probably needed to be watered twice. I did also pick off all the deadheads from the marigolds. There were quite a few, so I cleaned those up and everything else looks like it's doing pretty good. Um, so I'll wait probably a week or two and give y'all another update, but I'm really excited how it turned out. I think it's really cool that you can just water up here and then it waters the entire planter. So that just saves a lot of time, I feel like. So that's pretty cool. She's playing in dirt. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I'll update you in a week or two and we'll see. I did have a couple, um, let's see, actually three. I had these flowers, these flowers, and a few marigolds left over. So I think I'm going to put them in that pot. So yeah, I'll see you again in a week or two. I want to stay here for a while. I want to go. It has been one week since I've planted my green stock planter and I'm pleasantly surprised with how everything is doing. After we planted the herbs and flowers, it has rained a lot. So I feel like that's really helped the growth with everything. The marigolds are doing great since I picked the dead heads off. I've gotten a lot of new flowers. The lavender is starting to flower. The oregano, it's doing okay. It's probably doing the least great out of all of them, but it's still doing okay. Rosemary's grown a bunch. Um, the parsley's doing really great. I'm actually gonna have to pick some of this soon, but there's also a lot of new growth in there. If you can see, the flowers are doing good. The thyme is beautiful. It's doing great. And some more lavender. Parsley over here, there's a bunch of new growth on this parsley as well more lavender this one's starting to flower up a bunch and this miniature tomato plant it's not doing anything honestly i don't really expect it to <laughs> i don't have high hopes for this one um, but yeah everything else is doing great so that's going to be it for this video i hope you did enjoy watching me plant and explain how this planter works i do recommend one definitely especially if you have um, a small space to garden in or if you're not really dead set on a permanent gardening space yet this is great for like i'm doing flowers herbs or even um like beans or something like that i think would be good so i definitely recommend it i'll put the link where i got mine down below um, but yeah, that's going to wrap up this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss what's going on around the farm. I do plan on doing a video um, using my herbs in the chicken coop. So stay tuned to find out what I'm going to do with those. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye. Crawling on my floor When I just want to lie here Nothing less, nothing more There's raindrops on my window I'm going nowhere fast 
Behind these closed eyes I visualize what will come and what is past 